Hi there, my name is Jensen Kinsel. I'm a sophomore here at Gonzaga University and I'm from Bellingham, Washington. Um, currently, I am pursuing a degree in applied mathematics with a concentration in statistics and economics. I'm also looking at getting a minor in general business. Uh, on campus, I'm involved in club soccer and club soccer or spike ball. And I'm a ton involved in a ton of intramurals. I also have two on-campus jobs. I work with the athletics department, uh, working with facilities and events, just working at all of the sporting events. Um, and then I also work as a student host. Uh, in these next videos, I'll talk about a little bit more of my Zag life and what you guys can expect. Hi there again, uh, I'm back. Now I will be talking about residence halls. Uh, last year as a freshman, I lived in Coughlin Hall, which is the newest freshman dorm. And that is a traditional style dorm, meaning that there's two beds, so two people live in there as roommates, and then the front door to the room is attached to a hallway, which everyone's front door is attached to. So when you walk to your room, you're walking by tons of other freshmen's dorms as well. And it's a great way to meet people, uh, meet new friends, talk. You can just have a conversation as you're walking by. Um, it is a great time. I love it. Uh, so right now I'm in Kennedy Apartments, which actually looks pretty similar to Coughlin in terms of traditional style dorms. You have a desk, a bed, a bed, and a desk. This is pretty standard for more, most uh, freshman residence halls, especially at Gonzaga, they're all very similar. Um, but I love them, they're all great, and I hope that you enjoy yours too. Hi there, so as I mentioned before, I'm going to be talking about Zag Life and extracurricular activities here on campus. Right now, I'm here at Mulligan, the turf field here at Gonzaga, and they're playing some flag football. Uh, this is not rare for Gonzaga. Each week, uh, daily even, uh, there's intramurals going on, volleyball, soccer, basketball, flag football, um, spike ball, cornhole, uh, really anything. Uh, here at Gonzaga, we like to have fun. Uh, I'm involved in club soccer and club spike ball. Uh, those have been super fun for me this year. Um, there's tons of things here to get involved in on campus. There's spike nights on Friday and Saturday nights, which is just random things. Um, they do silent disco. Uh, they did bubble soccer last week. Um, in town, downtown is beautiful. There's paths to walk to it. Uh, Riverfront Park is really pretty. Um, there's tons of parks to go to around here. Um, there's a mountain to go skiing at. At Gonzaga, there's a ton to get, to get involved in. Um, so now I'm going to be talking about my favorite place on campus. This is the kennel. This is the McCarthy Athletic Center. This is where our Gonzaga basketball team plays. Um, last weekend it was super fun. We had a home game against number five ranked Texas and the student section right behind me here was super rowdy, uh, super fun. And we had to tent before the game actually. We had to stay the night uh, in one of the fields on campus in a tent in 30 degree weather just to get a good seat uh, to this game. It was really worth it and I would completely recommend it uh, once you guys come here. Uh, so yeah, this is my favorite place on campus. Lastly, I'm going to be talking about academics. So here at Gonzaga, I feel like the two most important things are the professors and the class size. 99.9% uh, .9 of the time, you'll be in a class with 30 people or less. I currently have a class with eight people, um, which is actually really nice. Uh, and then the other part is the professors. The professors here at Gonzaga want to be your friend as well as your professor. You can talk to them about things outside of class, your personal life, or you can go into their office hours, which they held um, after class, where you can go talk to them one-on-one -on -one and get personal adjustments, personal feedback, uh, which is super nice. I email my professors all the time, and they give me quick, timely responses, uh, which is really helpful for my learning. So those would be the two most important things to me, the professors and the class size. Uh, at Gonzaga, uh, those are two of our high standards. Well, anyways, thank you for listening to my vlog today. I hope you enjoyed it, and go Zags!